We're coming up this week on a holiday called Lag Ba'omer, the 33rd of the Omer. The Omer, as you mentioned a number of weeks ago, is a counting of the days up to the receiving of the Torah. And on the 33rd day, something very special happened. There's a great rabbi, his name is Rabbi Shimon Bar Yochai, and he revealed certain secrets of the Torah which were hidden to that time. And those secrets we have today. And it was a great day, and the story says he taught the Torah and he wanted to finish before, and that was the day of his death before he died, and he kept teaching and teaching, and the sun actually did not set till he finished all of the learning he wanted to do. And it's a great day, and certainly in the land of Israel, they pray by the holy site in Meron, where Rabbi Baruchai is buried. And it's important for us to understand that there are secrets of the Torah. But what does that mean? There are secrets, the things that are secrets, they are revealed. And to best understand it is we have to always look at life from a number of angles. There's what we see in front of us, and there's what's really behind the scenes, what we think. And we have to trust in God that the same way when we help someone out, there's a special force that's allowing us to do so, and we're helping them, and it's causing great, great things in heaven. We have to look at life that way as well. Don't look at the simple things we do as minor things. Every little bit you do, uh, helping someone cross the street, carrying a bag for someone, you do great things. We may not see them. We may not see the great things they accomplish, but we believe that they have great source of enjoyment of God in heaven. And when he sees the little acts that we do, he brings down blessings to this world. And we'll now continue with the singing of Lechadodi, the song we sing Friday night, written by the great Rabbi of Shoma Alkabitz in the late 1400s. Lechado hodi lekras kala pnei shabbos nekabela lechado hodi lekras kala pnei shabbos nekabela shamor v'zachor v'dibur echad Eshmiyahanukelhamyukhanhashemechodushmahoyachodleshemosefarezvelesilachadodilekraskalah <laughs> Ki hi me kor ha berach ha meirosh mi kedem nesucha Tov ma se be machshav achila lecha dodi lekraz kala Pnei shavos nekabela mikdash melech Ir melucha kumiti mitocha hafecha Rav lach shevez v'yemecha bocha v'ho yachamol Ala yichem la lecha dodi lekras kala Pnei shavos nekabela hisnari meofar kumi Live she big day, sefer te chami, al ya ben ye shai beis alach me. Karva el nav she ge yahala lecha dodi lekras kala. Nehe shabos ne kabela his horary his horary. Kiva horekumi yari. Uri, uri, shir da beiring, avod Hashem, alayich nigla. Lecha da hodi lekras kala, nei shavaz nekabela, v'hayul mshisa, shahosayich, v'racha kukom evahalayich, yosis alayich elokayich, Kim sozcha sana alkala lecha dodi lekras kala Pnei shavos nekabela yamin usmol tehefrozi V'yez Hashem da'aritzi 
Al yad ben Yishai beit alach mi karva el nav shige ala lecha dodi lekras kala ne shabbos ne kavila ba we b'shalom atares ba'ala gamberi na ovitzahala. Hochemune am segula, but we kala, but we kala lecha do di le cross kala. Ne shabos ne kabila. We are now over the halfway point of counting, of counting to the holiday of Shavuot. And one of the questions is always asked is that we count up. We count the days up in the Omer. It says 25, 26, 27. Why do we have a countdown? Usually something exciting, you count down to something. Count down how many days to your birthday, how many minutes till, till New Year. Why for the Torah do you count up? And the answer is that when we count down for something, yes, it's a great moment, but then the moment's over. You're counting down the days to your birthday, and you finally hit tomorrow's my birthday, and you get your birthday, and then it's over. And there's nothing else there. It's zero. We're down to zero. But when we're receiving the Torah, which is our book of life, it's counting up. Because once we hit that moment, the 49th day, we count, the 50th day, we receive the Torah, we still keep going up and up. It's a ladder, we keep climbing. It doesn't end. It's a journey with God only begins once the Jewish people receive the Torah. We're now finished with the singing of Adon Olam. Adon Olam, Asher Malach, Betarem Kol Yitzir Nivra. The ace nasa bechev so kol azai mehalech shemonik havi achare kechlos hakol levahadoyim loch nara vuhaya vuhove vuhiye besifarah vuhechad viyin sheni. Ham shilo lehach vira, vili reishis, vili sachlis, vilo haot, viha mitra, vilo keli, viha goali, vitor hevli, vies nasa, vilo nisi, umanosli, minas kosi, vio Abiyahado of Kidruhi, Eazishan, Via Ira, Viam Ruhi, Gaviasi, Ado Shemli, Velo Ira. I have a happy and healthy week, a great weekend, a great Shabbat. We'll see everybody next week.